Hello guys, this is uh, Mr. Al Capone, 11301, and my son, Aiden. what's your name? Aiden. Aiden. Cole. Cole. <laughs> and um, I just wanted to, I hadn't really shown, I don't have a whole lot, but I hadn't shown my Star Wars figures. I figured I'd show a few of those, and uh, you guys have gotten me to pick up a few Hot Wheels cars. And um, I wanted to just kind of show you guys that and a couple other little things that I just picked up at a yard sale. So um, let's take a look and see what I got. Yeah, let's see what we got. Okay. These, these are my Dark Vaders. Lost a helmet to this guy. He's got some cuts and stuff on his head. I'm sure you guys have seen these, but and my little Anakin, I got him and the variant. They're not very much in difference, but there's a there's a little bit there's a little bit difference in them. One of my favorites of all time is Skywalker man in this uniform and the removable helmet. I love that man. I love it. I mean, I think this is one of the coolest coolest ones. I don't know why I love it so much, but I just thought that's badass. Um, let's move through these guys. Some old, some new, some newer than others, but a couple of my absolute favorites. He's the, uh, one of my, this is one of the uh, originals, like almost one of the first ones, if he hit in the first, I can't remember. And uh, I ended up with the brown snake that goes to one, and this is the one that holds the, the orange, but and this is absolutely one of my favorites. This thing's awesome, man. It comes with a little stand. It's all wired up, the original, before he gets his work done to him. Got a little mill away here. Mace Windu, episode one, sneak preview. Star Wars, episode one, coming to a theater in your galaxy, summer of 91. Or 99, I'm sorry. This is uh, my favorite of these guys, this one. This is my next favorite with the opening panels, the tools, and I love this. He has the pull out, and then to wind it up, spin his head. And then it rolls back in. Missing the helmet. I don't know what my deal is with the helmets, but he's got the hook. the guys that everybody loves to hate but I, I to me man Jar Jar is one of my favorites man I, I don't I love them I love Jar Jar um, everybody else hates them I don't know why but I thought he was awesome and cool but a few troopers like I said I don't have a whole lot of these but this is what I've got Some of all the miniatures. Oh, that's great. The big one here. And can someone tell me, is this a Sig 6 uh, G.I. Joe? He's got these things that uh, hook to the both hands. 
that look something like that when you hook them up. I just got them unhooked. Got both. But uh, I can't figure out what the. It looks like one, but I don't know who it is. And and it was made by Hasbro. Can't remember the date. Right now, and my eyes are too bad. It'll take me 30 minutes to finally see it and figure it out. Um, I don't know why to put. You guys have seen this already. This is pretty cool. Um, I was just made aware, man. This thing is selling for like $170 on eBay, and some of them incomplete, like mine. There's, I'm missing the two little flagpoles because they were so thin, you know, they're obviously going to break off. Uh, but without the flags, man, I mean, this thing is selling for, selling for $170. Absolutely stupid, retarded. And whoever pays that for it is just as retarded as the person that sold it. I mean, come on. does enhance the feeling of owning this <laughs> knowing it's worth almost two hundred dollars but uh just thought i'd let you guys know if anyone has one that you know because i had it in a box out in the garage had no idea that it was worth that so felt a little bit more important now so i kind of pulled it out of the garage and put it on the bookshelf <laughs> but wanted to let me speed up i wanted to show you guys this pick this up at a yard sale absolutely awesome this finger detail is awesome. It's kind of like a statue. Um, it's There's no articulation. Very hard plastic. But this thing, man, is so sweet. His hair, the detail, and the sword. I mean, everything. This thing is just beautiful. The camera is not going to give it justice, but... Picked up this guy. Never even knew they'd done these little miniature Destro got arm articulation head spins legs forward and backwards no no waist no spin at the waist but no hand joints but pretty cool man I've never even seen these but anyway and up a few Hot Wheels. This is the uh, Boulevard Cruiser. Bruiser, I'm sorry. This thing, man, is so beautiful. The paint, uh, my camera's crap. For some, I got to get the settings right on it. It's actually a really good camera, but can't never figure out the right settings and everything to get it right. But It's got the flake sparkle paint job. Very beautiful car. 69 Chevy Nova awesome got the black rims man this is a badass car dude badass car and I was so happy to find this the 81 DeLorean DMC with the opening hatch all black the chrome racing rims Then of course I've got the Back to the Future. Everybody's got that. Found me another Volkswagen Type 181. Wasn't a big Hot Wheel collector, but always have liked and collected uh, the Volkswagens. I don't have a lot. I got a few, but I'm getting into it more and more now, thanks to uh, Mr. Sensitivity and uh, Remarkable and few other you guys please forgive me if I didn't name you hope your feelings aren't hurt but it's rubbing off on me action figure united I believe you're one uh, Ronnie K and all you guys over there most excited the Batmobile and this thing is badass it's got the flat black no shine flat black hardcore as hell this is one of the sweetest Batmobiles I've ever seen done on a Hot Wheels it's got the red front visor in the grill. 
the flat black just sets this thing off chrome windshield chrome hood uh the little motor scoop thing whatever those are called the red it just that flat black man just does it chrome rims man it just this car is one of the coolest batmobiles i've ever seen it's the batman batmobile and it's a, a track stars if anybody likes it and tries to find one and I've got the other Batmobile. This is the uh, Arkham Asylum Batmobile, which is awesome too. It's got the shiny acrylic black. It's not the flat. It's still a cool, still awesome, but to me, that other one's killer, man, with the flat black. It just, it's mean looking. And I got a few that I picked up in a yard so, or a while ago, not recently, but these are some of my favorites, man. They're out of the package. I love the clear hood. The paint job on this thing you don't want me to look at dates right now because it'll take it like i said 20 minutes i forget the name of this uh arachnophobia hot wheels this one's awesome the clear ice blue with the chrome spider on it and then this one the police car it's got the uh chrome uh, chrome blue painted wheels police tag on the side and it's clear for all blue plastic see-through awesome car anyway i don't want to take up no more of you guys' time hope you guys enjoyed my little star wars collection and my new hot wheels pickups thanks to you guys i will be doing another video here in just a minute on some things i'd like to say about some people